guys, as $410 million sell-off hits the market, Shiba Uno has managed to skyrocket by 110% in volume. Now, isn't that impressive? Let me show you those details right now in my video. Check this out. This spike in activity comes amid a broader market sell-off that has resulted in $410 million in liquidation. Now, according to CoinMarketCap's data, Shiba Inu's trading volume has more than doubled since the past day, marking a 110% increase to reach 34.1 trillion SHIB or almost $801 million in fiat currency. And by the way, why don't you help me out by smashing the like and while you're there, subscribe to my channel and switch on that notification bell to get my latest video. Anyway, you might be asking what does this all mean? Let me show you. This surge in trading volume indicates, guys, a significant rise in buying and selling activities as traders react to the current market condition. The dramatic increase in volume suggests heightened interest and engagement with Shiba Inu, even as the broader cryptocurrency market experiences a substantial sell-off. As the cryptocurrency market currently faces a massive sell-off, as investors digested a strong non-farm payroll number for May, sparking concern that the Federal Reserve may not be decreasing interest rates as quickly as expected, resulting in $410 million in liquidation, according to CoinGlass data. Now, what is even more interesting, Bitcoin and cryptocurrency sell-off further accelerated after Keith Jill, known as Roaring Kitty, hosted a highly anticipated YouTube live stream for the first time in several years. And guess what? GameStop shares fell dramatically, impacting a barrage of meme coins. And Dogecoin is down by 10% over the past 24 hours. Shiba Inu also fell by 8% in the same time frame and Pepcoin fell by 11%. Now, this reason for the surge in Shiba Inu trading volume may be varied. Traders may be taking advantage of the volatile market condition to speculate on SHIB's short-term price movement. Driving up the trading volume, investors could be reallocating their holdings, moving funds into or out of SHIB in response to a broader market trend and liquidation. Likewise, Shibami, the market dip might be prompting both panic selling and optimistic buying, with some traders exiting their position to avoid further losses while others see the dip as a buying opportunity just like myself. Now why don't you tell me down below, did any of my listeners or subscribers manage to buy the dip? Would love to know what my people are up to and if you did, how much did you buy and how much Shiba Inu are you holding? Now why don't you tell us down below. Now ladies and gents, this brings me to the end of the article and also to the end of the video. So do hope you guys did get some value. And remember, guys, if you did, let me know by smashing that like. And while you're there, don't forget to karate chop that subscribe and switch on that notification bell to get my latest update. Two companies control the world, and yet you don't know them. When we think of the world's most powerful companies, we often think of Apple, Google, or Amazon. However, these companies are small potatoes compared to the two behemoths that are BlackRock and Vanguard. BlackRock and Vanguard are the world's two most powerful investment funds, with over 15 trillion in assets under management, roughly five times France's GDP. So how do these two companies control the world? The answer is simple. Vanguard and BlackRock own shares in all the world's most powerful companies. They are the largest shareholders in Google, Apple, Facebook, Amazon, and Microsoft. They are true financial monsters. They own absolutely everything. Pharmaceuticals, transport, banking, media. It's simple. Every time you do something, you make BlackRock and Vanguard richer. Look at T-Fun. You make Vanguard richer. You go on Instagram. You make BlackRock richer. You buy an iPhone you make Vanguard richer. And the most terrifying thing is that when you make Vanguard richer, you also make BlackRock richer. After all, the two companies are each other's largest shareholders, 